Alrighty, there it is. We're live. Coming to you live. Game. All right, there we go. <laughs> Where the sun don't shine, cause it's right. dark. <laughs> right, because it is dark outside and inside. It is. I mean, technically, the sun could shine my there very if being. you went to a, you know, a no, uh, not in my soul. A nude beach. S sun doesn't go there. Doesn't go there in your soul. So, Alright, so let, let's get into this as we're jumping here. Let's do it. So, Sneak, do you think uh, video games cause violent behavior? No. You don't think so? Inside video games? Definitely. Outside of video <laughs> games? No. Because, well, like, inside video games, you can definitely tell. Because, like, people that take games really see I'm a really competitive gamer. It's very true. He I is. really am. I can attest oh, to shit, that. Oh, shit, there's a guy on it. Uh, we're, we're dropping hot again. Uh... Okay, I'm gonna try to go off to the side a little bit. I'm not gonna go right wait, wait. into it. It's. I see it people. seems like no. I think he passed it. Yeah, it looks like he's going past it. Oh my! Did you, well, there's God. a car. I know what you mean. Like when when you lose, it's so frustrating that it's like ah, you just want to like yeah. kill somebody. But I feel like the difference is like. You and I, we know the difference it's, between what's video games and what's, you know, like we're yeah, not actually I mean, gonna go out and game. kill it's somebody. All like fun, it's know, just a game. Doing. Like, yeah. See, there's a lot of people that have tried in the past when video games are, you know, really starting to first become a thing. You know, saying that oh, Grand Theft Auto makes you go out and murder people and rob stores. No, if you're if you're a mentally sound human being. That a video game is not gonna cause a difference whatsoever. If exactly. you're mentally unsound, well, then you're probably gonna do those kinds of things anyway. Right, regardless, like, <laughs> like it's, it's it all comes. It's back not the to game. The, yeah. Oh yeah. yeah. It all comes back to like your upbringing and like what you're exposed to as a kid. And a lot of people say that. No, like, don't people, do that. Don't do what you're doing. I'm you're not going all die. the way down. I'm not going all the way down. It's fine. <laughs> it's fine. I can make it. But how are you gonna get down from there? That's what I'm saying. I can make it. Oh, it's not as bad as I thought it was. Nah, I thought this was a lot worse. <laughs> nah, it's... Oh. oh, a crossbow. Oh my god, so many decisions. Can I have all of three of them? No, <laughs> don't go with the crossbow, please. Oh no, I can't. <laughs> Damn it! <sighs> a lot of people say, like, when you defend video games and stuff, you're saying that, like, kids of young age should have... should be able to play this kind of stuff, but... I don't agree with that at all. I mean, it's the same thing with movies, you know. Like, yeah. You don't want to expose your children to the to like death and gore and stuff at like a really young age, like that. I still, you know. See, I've that's why the ESRB re ratings are like definitely important. come across that. Oh yeah. Yeah, I've come across that kind of shit where like I remember you know being being young even like when San Andreas came out, you know, because you know I'm a young, I'm a youngin. Oh yeah, you're a bit of a youngin. And, uh, oh yeah. Oh yeah. So like whenever, whenever, fucking San Andreas came out, I remember you know like my dad uh, first bought uh, an Xbox mm -hmm. from a buddy of his at work, and you know he picked up, he picked up San Andreas and was like, you know I'm gonna play this before you're allowed to touch this, <laughs> Smart. and then I'll let you know if you're allowed to play it. Smart. And I was like, but why? My friends play it, and like, and I'm sitting here like, you know, They're looking okay. back at that, I'm like, you know. As fun as it would have been to play that game, I can definitely understand at my age why my dad was like, yeah, no. Oh yeah, oh yeah, definitely. If you can play it, because I will say there are some games that are like Halo. Mm -hmm. It's rated M, and yet like 95% of the reason it's rated mature is because of blood that's fucking blue and fucking purple because of aliens. Like, right, it's more I cartoony. I don't really consider that to be a big deal. Right, Yeah, exactly. like if, if they're splurting out blue and purple blood, like. There's a little bit of red blood from humans, but it's not that graphic. I mean, Halo is one of those games that I don't really feel like it should be rated M. Right. I mean, half the cartoons that kids watch these days have the same amount of, you know, like, violence oh, yeah, and gore. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's not... Like, that kind of stuff is fine. I think there is, like, a difference between, like, realistic, realistic gore and realistic death and, like, you know, more cartoony stuff. Yo, I'm very concerned about this choice to walk across this river we right now. We got this. We're good. We're good. I feel so, I feel so vulnerable. We're good. So I know you do. I know you do. It's okay. 
Oh dear. We should probably get down. We should probably get down. And we don't have to crawl, but we should <laughs> like, we're not. keep an eye out. Crawl. I'm so not I, crawling. I just want to get. Oh, oh, I, I, there's some guy right there. I see him. I don't think he sees. Where? Him. Uh, he's at 115, 110, 105. Oh, I see him at the fence. Oh, there's two guys. Yep, at the fence, yep. Oh. You realize we gotta go in that direction almost, right? Yeah, but... Maybe we can kill a couple people before we get there. Oh, there's a bunch of people over there, man. I took a couple shots at that one guy at the fence, but I didn't get him. Oh, I'm taking shots too, but... I got a silencer though, so us me taking shots, they're not gonna hear me. Oh shit, you're right. They might they might Oops. notice you. Whoops. In that building. Oh we need to get going. That circle's right on us, dude. Oh shit. Oh shit, yeah. Here, here, just make a hard right. Like stick to the kind <laughs> yeah. of the shoreline, I guess. Oh yeah. Yeah. Cause those guys are very curious where they're getting shot from. Oh shit. Are you getting lit up? Oh fuck. No, I'm good at the moment. Okay, I'm too. I just I heard that gun. It's really close. But... We need to going still though. That we're not. E ah, fuck. Let's just go up this hill. Let's try to get up this hill. <laughs> Do you think that the view of video games causing violent behavior is just an excuse to validate people's behaviors? Like you know, like these shooters um... and stuff. Like people go and look into their their past and what they like, and they like find video games. But it's like, you know, anybody can like video games. It, just because you like these shooting games doesn't necessarily mean that you are. It's because of them that you're doing this. I mean, to some extent, maybe that could be true. But I've, I've I've met people too that like, I've had a buddy on here that I didn't really talk to anymore. But he doesn't play shooter games. You know, he play, he'll play like melee games and stuff. But he absolutely refuses to play shooter games because he's a vet, and like. He just has PTSD about guns and shit. Oh wow! So he just can't play shooter games. It just messes with him. Wow, that's damn. That's crazy. I mean, you know, I yeah, totally and I mean, understand. Me being though, a person you know, I would totally games, understand. Like, yeah, yeah. Like I grew up. You did it again, you motherfucker! I'm sorry. way up here in this hill. Like, I'm sorry. Right I'm down. sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> I get so antsy. I get so antsy. Oh, no, it's it's cool. It's cool. Do you think violent video games desensitize like us and kids to violence and death and stuff? I definitely feel like it does to an extent. Like me going around shooting somebody in a game, you know, killing somebody, you know, as it would be in real life. Shit, I thought I heard a door open. Scared the shit out of me. Yeah, we gotta <laughs> get going. Fuck. Gotta jump out. Jump out. But at the same time, though, it's not really just the video games. Just society as a whole, everybody doesn't care anymore. It's more about money. And then you got the snowflakes. You got a lot, <laughs> a lot of snowflakes. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. People who are offended I by do mean everything. A lot of snowflakes. In existence. Why do you think that is? By the way, I literally saw an article today. Uh huh. Okay, sorry. No, you're okay, there's two people right here. Where? Killed one. Which direction are you shooting? At 155. Oh, shit. He ran behind a tree. I dead up killed his buddy. He was trying to heal. He's still but we gotta get in there, though. This is, get, this is gonna, like, uh, I think so. This is gonna really expose us. Oh yeah, he's getting shot at by somebody else. Now I'm nervous. Somebody on the hill is shooting at the guy I was just gonna about to rush. Ooh. All right. Now 16. I'm nervous. We got this. Ah fuck! Now we gotta go this way anyway. Well. Oh my God, run! I'm just running, man. Yeah, oh. this guy. Yeah, dude. This. Oh. 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 Dude. Where was he? Holy shit, yeah, this it's the guy over here. It's the guy over here. He's 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 at one fifty five still. I lit him the fuck up though. We gotta get moving. Fuck it. Here, we're going through the middle. We're going through the middle of all of them. Fuck it. Oh, shit. Getting shot at. Oh fuck. Yep. 
That's a weeb. That's oh a weeb. Oh my god. Oh shit. Oh well, no. If we don't get oh, over no. here, like the circle's already about to move. Oh no. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. I, I can't oh. see where he's shooting. Ah, oh, fuck. Now he's shooting me. Well, I took some fire for you. <laughs> Thanks. I got hit once. Here, come on. We gotta go. We gotta go. Do the shit. circle. Oh, it's shit. already moving. Oh shit. Where the fuck is that coming from? That building right there. Yeah, it's fuck, right here. Fuck, I couldn't find out where the hell it was coming from. No, he's still in there. Make sure I you know. get him. I know. Fuck me, get him. It's too dark. Oh, shit. Oh, he got... Oh, fuck. He lit me up. It Damn. was too dark. I couldn't see fucking shit. Yeah. But uh, Call of Duty World of War, you know, it was... It was the first game that, to my knowledge, that was graphic enough as far as a war game to where I could come up to you, shoot you with a double barrel shotgun, and it would clean blow your legs off and I could see your intestines hanging out of your chest. Whoa. If you like if you like headshot somebody with a sniper rifle, like their skull would crack and you could see part of their brain sticking out. Like it was the first actually graphic shooter game to my knowledge. Whoa. But whenever he came into office, he put either laws or restrictions in place to where they did they couldn't for quite some time make video games to that caliber like they hmm. they couldn't make the gra games graphic like that it just seeks to exist you for the longest time you did not see any type of realistic um like historically accurate game of that caliber have some kind of you know depiction like that but, Damn. I mean, that's what war is. You know, war is graphic. War is intense as shit. And, you know, I, I could be wrong on that. You know, don't quote me 100% you know, percent oh, yeah. on all oh, this. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You know, you think back to Call of Duty now. Mm -hmm. All you think about is little kids. Oh, yeah. Like, Call of Duty used to be an extremely tactical military shooter. It was not to be taken lightly. You know, it was a really, you know, fun graphic game. And now it's like you got people fucking breakdancing and wearing clown masks and doing all this retarded ass shit and call of duty is just a flat piece of shit now. right because it's like you said like it's i mean it's like just it's the, the the fan base are like younger kids now and it's yeah you know, that's i mean it's it's definitely gone downhill as far as like what you can do with it because now you can't make it like that because you've got all these like young kids playing it and if you make it graphic if you make it to that kind of caliber again then you're gonna have parents bitching like oh well my kids can't play this because of it like well they shouldn't be playing that right it's not for children i mean there's ratings on these games for reasons you know like it's not like yeah you know a lot of parents i feel like a lot of parents like have they like don't care they don't I feel like a lot of parents don't really give a shit about the rating systems at all. You know, there's just like, oh, it's a oh, game, yeah, it's definitely. fine, you know, it's it's not gonna hurt anything, it's, it's all fake, you know, it's like cartoons, but a lot of this stuff is pretty realistic, you know, like it's, it could definitely mess you up, like as a kid, and especially if you're playing it like this young. And that's not to say like every kid who plays this is gonna be like, you know, like a mass murderer or something like that. It's just, you know, it could, I feel like it possibly could facilitate, like, you know, if you're, if you have that in you, if you have that upbringing, you know, if you have that kind of... Yeah, we are, you're going opposite way of circle, we might have started wanting to go that way. <laughs> I was getting into what I was saying. <laughs> but I mean, I mean game, like, games as a whole, I, I don't really think that violence ha in these video games has much of an impact on anything. Especially just with how demonetized everything as far as violence and everything as a whole is. Oh, yeah. And honestly, what really... You know, here's one thing that I'd like to bring up. What confuses the fuck out of me is how violence is so completely demonetized. But yet, if I say that you shouldn't act that way or you shouldn't be a certain way, it's so offensive that you gotta flip your fucking shit. <laughs> Yeah, it's like you, you can't know what I have mean? an opinion without somebody else being like, oh, this, 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 and yeah, this. Yeah, like, like you got an opinion saying. and somebody's going to throw an absolute shit fit about it, but yet, you know, fucking murdering somebody, oh, that's fine. Right. See, that's the thing. It's like people don't, they're, people can't reach a consensus on what is okay and what's not. And I mean, that's fine because, I mean, that's part of, like, what America is. You know, you can raise your kids how you want to. You can give them... We're fucked up. That's what it <laughs> is. But that also, like, but yeah, like you said, that also leaves room for, you know, people to 
really royally fucked their kids up, and it's it's really sad, but you know it's. Well, I mean, see, we live in an age where you got like ten year old kids playing violent video games like Call of Duty, shooting their friends, talking about murdering their friends, blah blah blah, and you know, and if it's all fun and games, you know, it's fine. Mm -hmm. But at that age, you know, there's a four time scope. Come over here and get this. Definitely. At that age, I definitely don't believe that that should be happening. Period. Oh yeah. But you know, if you're if you're a teenager, if you're having fun, it's all in good fun. You know, you're not you're just you're not taking it seriously. You know, I you know I don't really see the harm in it. I don't see the harm in it whatsoever. It's it's a game. You know, big whoop. Oh yeah. But when you got all these children running around like this, like it shouldn't happen. It just yeah. flat out shouldn't happen. It's like, the other building. Even with Fortnite too, like. It's childish, yeah, but there's still death, there's still killing, you know, it's not graphic yeah. per se, but it's still like, you know, and I, and I feel like a lot of people, like since when a lot is of it parents okay? are misunder, misunderstanding. Yeah, where are you game. going? Yeah. Well, there's yeah. a motorcycle right here, let's take it. Alright, We're it's gonna take this motorcycle and hope we don't die. Probably our only hope, yep. Just fuck motorcycles in this game, dude. The motorcycles are a death trap. Can I even get on this thing? I don't think I can, yeah. man. Yeah, jump on the back. Oh, you're good. Get on, get on, get on. Go, 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 go. You almost died. This is oh why you gosh. get on the bike as quickly as possible. Oh, my gosh. Here, we get on, we're getting the buggy. Here, quickly get up. Oh, shit. No, we're not. Oh, no, God damn not. it. Ah, damn. He got me. Go across the bridge, man. Just hope you can make it. I hope I don't oh. get shot to living shit going across this bridge. Oh, That's what I'm hoping. Oh shit. Oh, it's so scary. Oh no. Oh, oh fucking no. fucking bike stop bouncing. <laughs> well. Well, this is a predicament. I can't I can't leave the vehicle. What do you mean I can't leave the vehicle? Let me off this thing. <laughs> and I'm dead. Oh. So, do you think oh. there should be more like laws and regulations to kind of keep violent video games out of kids' hands? Or do you think it's probably oh, good how it is, and it's just the not, parents' fault? Not really, because it, it's you can't buy the game unless you're 17. Right. It's your parent. It's this like it, uh, let's go ahead and jump. By the way, I'll put a marker in like a town. I don't know if this is gonna go over very well, but we'll see. Yeah. But we'll yeah, see. I mean, it's it's really it really has nothing to do. Like the kid cannot get a hold of that video game without somebody of 17 years of age. Or older, right. buying the game for them. Unless they like buy it online. So or I really don't with their parents' credit card, but yeah, but I don't know. If I mean, even then, fun. that's your fault. You don't let your don't let your kid like steal your credit card. Right, exactly. <laughs> but that still all comes down to like you shouldn't have done that. Yeah, I mean, you really should monitor so, what your kids, you know, watch and consume. Dude, there's somebody landing with this, by the way. Oh, dude, there's like two teams landing with us, or three. I don't know how oh, many. There's so many people Get a here. Fucking oh, my God. Wick. Oh, this guy knocked me to death. Oh, two guys. Oh, they double teamed me. So, I know this is so random. Yeah. And so, have nothing to do with anything. But I want to share this just because it's the most fucked up thing I think I've ever seen on the internet. Oh, my God. Okay. So I was, I was scrolling through Facebook, right? And I found a news report, like a legitimate, like news station news report. Where well, this guy got arrested, right? Breaking yeah. into, doing uh, breaking and entering. He was breaking into people's homes and he was tying them down, but he wasn't raping them. And mind you, I mean, multiple homes. I'm talking about like three to four different homes. This man did this, but he broke in their homes to tie them down and tickle their butthole. Like, why? Why? Like, it's so <laughs> weird. Join a club or something where people let you really do that. I'm, like, start a club, <laughs> like the butt tickling club, and like invite people from Fucking Craigslist. Do You'll crack. probably have Cause people join. You... Yeah, like, but like, it's like, it would, like, I don't get it. Where are you at? Dude, I... you're so nowhere near where I'm at. How does this like, always nowhere happen? nowhere at all. How does this always well, happen? Well, I put a marker down, and you're just not following the marker. I'm going I'm for the marker. I am going for the marker. The hell you are? Look at the map. Shh. A lot of popular games these days, like, one of the main focal points are, like, guns and, like, you know, death. They're, like, shooters. First-person, third-person shooters. Um, 
do you think that that has like an effect on the way we view guns like especially kids like you know people see guns now as like a game almost I and mean, not necessarily as a deadly weapon I, I don't really think so. I don't really f think that that particularly plays a part in it really at all. At this point, we got the government trying to take our guns for literally any reason whatsoever. I do agree. I don't think video that. games particularly have anything to do with it whatsoever. Yeah, I mean, it's like, like I mean, I can understand where I can understand maybe to an extent that that's true. But in of this town, where are you going? You're going uh, outside a circle again. Where are you? I have one. Oh, there's a guy over here, man. And there's an ump in here. There's two guys over here. Is there? Over. Where at? Uh, right behind you. Right behind you. Yeah, over here. Over here in that shack. They went in that shack straight ahead. I saw one dude going like he's behind this first shack on the right. He's in here. No, he's not. No, there's a guy that's there's a guy over here, but he's not in it. Oh, he's in this one. He's in this one. He's watching the door. Hold up, I got a shotgun. Let me do it. Watch out for his buddy though. Got them both. Nice. They're both Good in job. there. They're both in Camping there. Camping out in the shack. Damn. Good job, yep. guys. You tried. I'm gonna loot him. Do it. I'm gonna bandage up here. I don't wanna I don't wanna waste the first aid. I want some camo hot pants. What the hell? Did I see camo hot pants? Sweet! I mean, I think it all goes back to like, you know, the kids and like their parents like letting them have it. Like, if you're a certain age and you play that kind of gory, violent stuff, it's like, you know, it just kinda rolls off your back. You know better, you know what's you know the difference between yeah. video games and real life, but when you're a kid and you're it's, like it's more of a exposed to it, kind of thing. right? Exactly. Like that kind of stuff is fine as long as it's in the hands of you know people who are mature enough to realize it's just a game. You know, when you give it to kids, and it's I not mean, just, not just a, that too, but like when you got like ten year olds that fucking getting in college. I fucked your man. I guess what? I fucked your man, man. Like, dude. They keep going. They stop. Yep, they they stopped, and I got one. He oh, was in the shit. building. Oh, where is he? Oh, I didn't. Oh, in the building. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh, sneak. Got him. Got this. Oh, oh, damn. I shot at them and made them crash, and they panicked and got out. Shoo! He went inside that building across the road. Like the, the one road. directly across the road. Yeah, 105. He's in that building. He's gonna come to us though. He's gonna have to come. Oh shit! Fuck! I'm dead. Behind you. There's a team directly behind you. There's two people behind you. Are you serious? They're outside that building directly to the right. Right you here. I want to reload. You only got eight bullets in that clip. Yeah, on the other side of that shed. Right on the other side of that shed, there's fucking two people. Fuck. Yep, there, there's one of them. Oh, shit. Ah. Uh, Windows. Damn it. All right. Well, I think that'll probably do it for this stream. You have anything else to add about violence and guns? I mean, you know. Oh uh, no, I don't think I think I'm It's clear that we're not gonna go out and shoot anybody. I'm afraid of guns. <laughs>